Welcome to the ClearPath Forward OS 2200 Software Release 20.0 Overview Session. My name is Chris Willinen. I am the OS 2200 Software Solution Manager. For some of you tuning in, you may have expected to hear Adam Gallagher introduce the latest OS 2200 release. In August of 2022, I joined the ClearPath Forward Solution Management team. Adam and I have been working together since then to hand off responsibility of the OS 2200 software to me while he focuses on OS 2200 software series and Dorado platform solution management. During this session, I will cover a brief introduction of myself review the highlights of the OS 2200 Software Release 20. We will look at the release support plan as well as take a look down the road. Finally, I will include an update on the all-important T-Date dollar changes in this release and actions that clients need to take. As I already mentioned, I joined the ClearPath Forward Solution Management team last August. Just a little bit about me until there comes a time when we can meet live online and or in person. Once again, my name is Chris Wilmanen. I have worked nearly my entire career for Unisys and in some form or another on ClearPath OS 2200. In fact, I started my career as a software developer on the OS 2200 Procedure Definition Processor, also known as PDP. It is nice to be making a full circle of sorts, but this time in Chuck Lefebvre's team, where I'm learning how we push the possible with ClearPath Forward. I am looking forward to serving OS 2200 clients in the Solution Manager role to provide operating system software that clients use to drive their business. Now, on to the 20.0 release update. The ClearPath Forward OS 2200 Software Release 20 General Availability Date is March 30th, 2023. Hopefully, you are tuning in shortly after this key release date. OS 2200 Software Release 20 includes more than 80 new features that bring business benefits to Unisys ClearPath Forward clients. Just about 40% of these features originated from you, our clients, submitting new feature suggestions and requests. This illustrates the focus of the OS 2200 team on delivering release content that allows clients to break through in achieving their business outcomes. In my role as a solution manager, I really appreciate the suggestions from our clients and encourage continued engagement for OS 2200 Release 21 and beyond. Just as a reminder from a previous announcement, all requests for software updates need to be submitted to your Unisys sales representative. In an effort to provide a uniform release update experience worldwide, Update software release notices are no longer being generated and emailed, so please take note. The key new features in this OS 2200 release are grouped into three categories of client benefits, security, performance, and ease of use. Let's look at the 20.0 release highlights in each of these categories. Security continues to be an important focus for ClearPath product enhancements to keep your business secure. The highlights here are only a partial list of the key security-related features in the OS 2200 Release 20. For full details on all new features, refer to the ClearPath OS 2200 software release announcement for Release 20.0 that can be found on the Unisys support site. The following security enhancements are included in ClearPath Release 20. The Transport Layer Security, or TLS 1.3 protocol, 
has been enabled in CPCOM OS. TLS 1.3 is the latest and most secure transport layer security protocol available. When performing an SSL TLS handshake, the default is to the TLS 1.3 protocol and Cypher Suite. Support of weak Cypher Suites has also been removed, further enhancing the security of OS 2200 environments. Apex and Flex products that are part of OS 2200 now support RADIUS Multi-Factor Authentication, or MFA. RADIUS is a standard protocol to accept and process authentication requests. The RADIUS MFA authentication module solicits user IDs for a secondary password, for example, a one-time use password or MFA code from a security token, in addition to the OS2200 password. The CPFTP product comes from our partner at Viprogy and is used for high-speed transfer of files between OS2200 and other computer systems. CPFTP has been improved to provide more secure FTP connections by using the client certificate on both the CPFTP client and the CPFTP server. This feature encrypts communication and enhances security by identifying clients attempting to connect and controlling access only to trusted clients. COM API and CPCOM OS security capabilities have been expanded to allow individual clients and applications to supply their own unique certificates and private key for a session or connection. Moving on to DEPCON, it's got security features with two new options. The first is enhanced PDF encryption with a 256-bit encryption level. You can create digitally signed PDFs with PDF Advanced Electronic Signatures, also known as PADES. The second feature allows for encryption of outgoing email messages using Federal Information Processing Standards or FIPS 140-2 compatible encryption algorithm. Operation Sentinel includes a new feature to log user information for starts and stops that are performed in the environment. Better monitoring and reporting enables better security and policy compliance for clients. IPSec on OS2200 is a new feature that encrypts communication between OS2200 and other devices that support IPSec, such as Stealth Virtual Gateway. Web Support is a brand new product in the OS2200 operating environment. Web Support provides an HTTP client interface that OS2200 applications can use to send HTTP requests and receive HTTP responses over secure SSL slash TLS connections, as well as non-secure connections from a Uniform Resource Identifier, or URI. You can see security of the OS2200 environment is top of mind when prioritizing and developing new features. Moving on to performance enhancements, ClearPath systems reliably process your business workloads with superb performance. These features have been added to ClearPath Release 20 to take performance monitoring to the next level. The exec includes a new tool with OS 2200 Release 20, the System Performance Monitor Enhancements and Scaling SPM feature. SPM is a new component for collecting and reporting statistics and collects the data previously collected by Software Instrumentation Package, or SIP, SIP. SPM modernizes the collection of system statistical data through finer granularity while minimizing the impact of data collection on system performance. 
SPM I.O. Trace replaces SIP I.O. Trace. Related to that, IRU now supports SPM Audit Trail enhancements that are also supported by Freestanding Audit Handler, or FSAH, and IAP. To enhance the ClearPath user experience, these are just some of the new features in OS 2200 Release 20. With this release, Database Agent, or DB Agent, provides additional RDMS table information to allow database administrators to better maintain their databases. The DBAs will be able to see the utilization of RDMS storage areas and manage thresholds for alert generation. This is a big benefit when it comes to identifying and remediating risks before they become issues. The new Exact System Performance Monitor component delivers reformatted collection of I.O. trace data. The data is written to a new audit trail, SPM IOT, to improve both performance and maintainability. The Operations Sentinel Topology Editor has been enhanced to identify objects more easily after they are moved along with the addition of a tooltip for objects in the topology view. These features improve the client experience when there are many objects filtered for the topology, such as in placement mode. These are a select few of the more than 80 new features included in OS 2200 Release 20. For those that are new feature suggestions from clients, many thanks and keep them coming. Now let's turn to the OS 2200 Release Support Plan and Solution Roadmap. OS 2200 Release 20 was made available on March 30, 2023 and will be supported through December 31, 2027. This is noted to be three months shy of the normal five-year support period. That is due to the upcoming T-date dollar date wrap that will occur in the operating system on December 31st, 2027 at midnight. I will cover more about T-date dollar in just a bit. Looking back at, at previous releases, the support for the OS 2200 release 18.0 has been extended through March 30th, 2024. While the OS 2200 19.0 release remains in support through July 31st, 2025. While clients are planning their OS 2200 upgrades, note that you can upgrade from OS 2200 release 19 to 20 or from release 18 directly to release 20. We continue to provide clients the option to skip a release level when upgrading. And looking ahead, OS 2200 release 21.0 is targeted to be released in the fourth quarter of 2024. This is shorter than the normal two years between releases. This is so that Unisys can work towards getting back to the two year cycle and the OS 2200 21.0 release date is an interim step in that direction. I will also call attention to the blue highlights that show the last OS 2200 release that supports a particular platform. OS 2200 release 20 is the last software release that supports the Dorado X400 platform series. Note as well that OS 2200 release 20 supports software series 2.1 and 3.0. For these and other dates that I've just covered, you can find the OS 2200 Software Support Plan on the Unisys Support site. Here is a view of the latest overall ClearPath Forward four-year roadmap for both OS 2200 systems and software. As you can see, there is more to come in 2023 and a busy 2024 is planned to deliver barrier-breaking solutions 
to advance your business and discover new possibilities. As promised, an update on T-Date Dollar as we are marching towards the December 31st, 2027 key date. Hopefully clients have been paying attention to the previous communication from Unisys on the T-Date Dollar issue that requires action and application updates in your environment. The T-Date Dollar change is part of the ongoing evolution of ClearPath OS 2200. After December 31st, 2027, 2300 hours, 59 minutes, 59 seconds, or at the stroke of midnight, the year portion of the T-Date Dollar timestamp format wraps, resulting in times that are ambiguous and considered invalid. This means that the database field that holds the year value overflows or wraps or resets to zero and begins incrementing again, thus the generation of dates that are no longer useful. The OS 2200 release 20 eliminates the creation of new T-Date dollar dates by ClearPath OS 2200 products with the exception of FreeSpace or FreeUps. The FreeUps change is coming with OS 2200 release 21. While the OS 2200 operating system software has been remediated, clients need to act on any application software that they have that uses T-Date Dollar. That action is needed before December 31st, 2027. Unisys has provided documentation and offers services to assist with identifying ER to T-Date dollar calls that are used in client environments and recommendations in updating your application software. Navigate to the Unisys support site to find that information and documentation. Contact your Unisys account representative or the support team to get more information on the services that are noted here. It is strongly recommended that clients update their applications as required and set the system parameters related to T-Date Dollar so that no T-Date Dollar dates are generated in their current operating environment in either OS 2200 release 18 or 19. Then, as you upgrade to release 20, retain those parameter settings that will prepare your OS 2200 environment for operation on the all-important December 31st, 2027 date. Unisys is here to assist clients with their T-Date dollar actions. Reach out to your Unisys account representative or Unisys support if you would like more information on T-Date Dollar and its implications. Thank you very much for spending time to hear about the features and key updates for ClearPath OS 2200 Software Release 20.0. Stay tuned to the Unisys ClearPath Forward YouTube channel for more updates. Connect with us on LinkedIn, Twitter, and Facebook for all of the latest news. Until next time, take care and have a breakthrough experience with ClearPath Forward OS 2200 Release 20.0.